Welcome back, welcome back, Natsumi na. I'm sorry, I'm late. <laughs> welcome, <laughs> welcome. Come on, come on, come on. Come back, come back, Natsu. Welcome to the Eternal Festival. I'm Natsu Haneko, and welcome to the very late stream. <laughs> Uh, I'm sorry about that guys I had a conversation with a friend and I didn't realize the time so I didn't realize it was already 8 o'clock sorry for being late for the stream anyway how are you guys today? <laughs> ah senor peko komba komba konatsu lechu komba komba konatsu sorry for the wait guys hmm. yabe I like I like took a shower really fast like after I had my conversation with my friend I literally like dropped the phone and like ran to like the shower and literally took a sh really like it was still a pretty long shower it was like 10 minute shower yeah <laughs> and then I was like I like put on my shirt like really quick and I was like uh, yeah I forgot my pants <laughs> uh, yeah I forgot to wear my pants all up. yeah There we go. Wait. Okay, I have my pants on. <laughs> uh, today we're gonna stream Kerbal. I meant Kerbal Space Program, Isekai X. So yeah. <laughs> yeah, bit. Oh my god. <sighs> oh. Um. Okay. Okay. Now I have my breath. So. We're gonna play Kerbal Space Program, Isekai X. And today we're gonna focus on building planes, boats, and VTOL stuff. Or vert vertical takeoff and lift. And probably an SSTO. And we're gonna launch something. We're gonna launch a rocket, a plane, a boat. We're gonna try it all today. So, let's get started. Oh, yeah, bit. Yeah, bit. <laughs> oh, just a moment. So we're gonna enter the space plane real quick. Don't worry, my stream is fine today. My stream is fine today. <sighs> we're gonna stream a long stream tonight. Today. Tonight? Today. Did I, say, did I just say tonight and today in one word? Oh my goodness. <sighs> Don't worry. <sighs> okay, so it's gonna take a while because... Um, Oh yeah, so I built this during the... I showed this to you guys like during the... I think it was like... During the Discord chat? Yeah, in the server. I showed you guys this one, right? So I tried flying this and... It was really unsuccessful. So... I want to try building something better. Like... I want to try building... Like something a little bit better than this one. Because we did take off hover-wise. But we didn't really like fly. Like legit, like we did not fly. So what I'm gonna do is build a new one real quick. This is actually based on the um the VVA one four, which is whatever this plane hover thing looked like. Anyway, I wanted to build a new one because I showed this on the server and it was like eh it didn't fly. Like it hovered, but that's it. And I knew, I knew what was wrong with this design because the the jets were actually facing well, just straight up. So I wanted to try something a little bit better. So let's get out a new part. So let's save this one and open up a new one. Okay. Well, on my end, it actually works though. Um. Uh, uh, let's see, let's see. <laughs> <clears throat> so we're gonna start off with a newer one. And I'm gonna use a mixture of uh, airplane parts. Uh, plus, which is like the mod. And stock parts. And yeah, actually it's gonna be a mix of mi mostly mod and stock parts. To build another version of this plane. Hopefully, we can get it to uh, actually take flight. So for this one, I'm going to use actually um, some Mark III 
Mark Mark 3 uh Okay, so, so we're gonna go a little bit more bigger and all that. So we're gonna use some Mark 3 parts. Um Well there's the cargo plane, but the problem with like the old one was like What's this? This Mark 3? Oh no, it's the, it's the wrong size. It's it's a smaller size. We're gonna use let's see. Hmm. We're actually gonna use the space shuttle one because it just looks nicer. And we're gonna go put a fly by wire. Will it fit? No, it's too. Hmm. Maybe if we put like a incline. No. Nope. Something like that. That doesn't look nice. <laughs> well, I'm gonna like use a little bit of the tweak scale mod. I know it's kind of bad to use maybe mods, but I'm using just this just so it looks nice and stuff. Yeah. Like that. And then what I'm gonna do here is take this take these two parts and just slide it right in just so it looks clean. Yep. And Oh wait, where's my stand? The stand on my phone disappeared. Hold up. <laughs> oh, yabe! Yabe! Yabe me na! Tutumate! Yabe! So this can be a long stream. So usually I stream for like 2 hours, so... I'm gonna try and stream for like... I don't know, 10 hours? Who knows? I still have school tomorrow, but... I'll try and stream for like 10 hours today. Tutumate! I'm just get my phone on the stand. よっぺ。よっぺ。マジで。え、ちょっと待って。うん。ちょっと待って。え、大丈夫。あ。いっ。あ、くそ。なんで。なんで。え、ちょっと待って。なんで。え、マジで。ちょっと。待って。はい。え
I, I don't know what I'm doing. I, honestly, don't <laughs> don't take my word for it. I kind of suck at this. Uh... Oh, yes. Something like that. Yeah, so it's like in the middle some somehow. We're gonna end up putting engines here later on, but... Actually... Should we put an engine here? You want to work on the body, though. Wait, that's more in the rear. Uh, I'm like nitpicky about this. Hold up. There, there. It's okay. It's like within the middle, which is good. I'm just gonna close this. We're not gonna use the cargo. It's just for like design or something. And what we're gonna do is... Uh, we're, we're gonna put like wings up here. And then like engines. So, let's see. Um... We're actually going to use stock parts for this one. So, we'll just configure the snapping. And... let's see. Right... here. Oh yeah, wait. I got a new overlay. I mean, well, it's my same overlay, but I updated it. How does it look so far? Hmm. I mean, it's the same thing. I the only thing I changed was like my uh, what's it called? I only changed my chat box, so it's more like see through. So that doesn't interfere with the game so much. Maybe like that low, and then what we're gonna do is double that. So using Alt left click, we're gonna just yeah. And what we're gonna do actually is put some struts. We're gonna take out the snapping. Just... Oh yeah, just yeah, just like right there. We don't want these parts to fall off later on. I don't have cheats on. Just saying. Oh, I don't have them on. Sadly, <laughs> I'll try not to cheat this game. So. There we go. What we're gonna do is move these two parts. We want them to be way up here. Like, we want them to be really up high. Maybe about this. Ah! Komba Komba Konatsu, Jeff! Hello, welcome! Uh, right. So, we want it to be a bit high. Because we're gonna tilt these wings later on, but... Gets way too high, so maybe like lower it down a bit. Yeah, that's way too high. Maybe about right here. It's a good, it's like really good one. And then. Oh, wait, just a moment. Yeah, wait. So if we just. Maybe like that. We don't want it to be too long. Then we're gonna like tilt. We're gonna tilt it. Let's take off snapping real quick. Wraith, komba komba kanatsu. Welcome. So we're gonna have to do this and then. Yeah, but like that. And then for these ones, actually, yeah. For these ones, we're gonna like make this kind of shape. So we're what we're trying to do here is basically make a VTOL aero like what's it called like ground VTOL ground effect type of plane. So usually in ESEC IX we're gonna throw some kerbals into the space, but uh offline Natsuha has been like having problems uh, trying to fly people into space. So um like, I, I have a problem making a working rocket, so I'm now focusing on isekai people using the Isekai X defense program. Instead of uh, launching people into space, we'll Isekai them through other means, such as flying a plane. <laughs> we want it to be a good one. And I'm gonna use two, two more of these. I want them to be, well, two more. To connect like two of these parts, so yeah, isekai. 
This is the Isekai X Defense Defensa. Uh, this is our defense um, division. So we're also uh, defending using Kerbals as experiment. So we have Mark three parts here. What we're gonna do now is use some airplane plus parts. Airplane plus parts, which is a size two. So let's see. Hmm. I, why do I hear myself? No streaming. Okay. Okay. Never mind. But we're gonna use this like size two parts. We do have snapping on, so let's just use our WD WASD keys to. <clears throat> so these things might be a little bit too big for pylons, but they will hold our fuel just because, um, well. These ones will hold our fuel. We want it to be a little bit big, but we'll just move this down. So we want them to be like low, but not too low. And then turn on the center of mass. And then like just maybe like right here. Because these will also act as us pylons and stuff for floating around. But let's see. Around there. Then right there. Then this one we're gonna just it like oh no not like that there we go what's your obsession with isekai people what is my obsession with isekai people um i watched a bunch of isekai anime a long time ago uh, mostly shield hero and arifureta and um the newer the new one uh, the one uh, about like reincarnating into the world's finest assassin uh reincarnating into uh, another world yeah i like that and then like the old classic ones um zero's familiar and all that stuff ah uh, yeah but i like uh isekai a lot <laughs> so i uh i watch a lot of isekai i want to be isekai one day no i'm just playing <laughs> i already am isekai in this human world <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna use Mark One uh, fuel tanks for this. I want to use. Last time we used uh, after burning jets, and they seem powerful, but something was wrong when I was using them. I think um, I just turned. So one thing I learned when we messed up building these things is that the engines are actually. So it's okay. I was gonna use these like Weasley turbo fan engines, but they didn't have enough power to actually lift this entire thing so i devised something much more simpler and it's uh we're gonna center this for a little bit so what's it called we're not i was gonna use the j33s which is okay but didn't create enough thrust that i needed so we're gonna use after burning fans and we're actually gonna turn off the gimbal on them so Let's just turn off the gimbal. And then... Um, we're gonna... I'm sorry for talking big brain language, but... I'm gonna put this here. So, these engines on the... On these wings will... Propel us... Qu hopefully... Forward. Upward lift. I... It's like we're going back to school again. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Um, so, but one thing I messed up with when we were building this is that, like, the the engines were like facing straight down, so they only went up, and then we would lose control. So, one thing I would do is uh, probably copy this first. Copy this, and then for this one, we're just gonna point it this way, just ever so slightly this way. And we want it to be pointed in an angle. So like, you know, like a pyramid. We want it to be like the engines in the front and the back to be pointed like towards the center like a pyramid. And then the engines in the middle 
will just be pointing straight down so that hopefully when we lift up we have enough like mass to lift ourselves up and keep us like balanced and stuff yeah big science talk i don't know what i just said by the way <laughs> um big brain talk yeah i have no idea what i just said but assuming we have we want two of these facing this way so we're actually gonna take another one and is it right here and then let's see essentially we want this to be able to i sound like a teacher yeah a bit <laughs> nothing wrong with being a teacher but uh it's like i'm going to school i just went to school earlier yeah a bit so i just want this to be a little bit balanced and these these two engines will fire thrust this way this way and we want engines to fire thrust this way as well so we're actually gonna take these two engines i'll click it this requires more thrust poundage than the weight of the vehicle but wait fill the plane with chocolate no no we'll fill it up with kerbals and make it uh. this will uh need this will have a lot of thrust let's just say i mean this is each engine uh one of these after burning engines uh let's see where's the engines these things create about stationary thrust about 85 knots and about 130 knots i have no idea what i'm too lazy to convert <laughs> anyway uh <laughs> they make very powerful these ones make about 120 but it's not they burn out quick they flame out easily i'm not sure <laughs> i could be wrong I, I i feel like i can like smell like angry pilots like in the distance like what <laughs> is she talking about <laughs> they want to create enough thrust like like end of the story like i wanted to create enough thrust like a pyramid like like thrust up here and then thrust down at the bottom pointing towards the middle because one thing i had a problem with the old design is that it would just go up and flip backwards so i want to let's see change this a bit move this down i want this to be moved down like not too down but maybe I'll that much i'm not gonna be too nitpicky on that one but let's try on this one as well yeah so you guys can lurk if you guys want this is a lot of building it actually the first design actually took me like an hour to build but don't worry i'll speed build this don't worry i got you okay so that's too high it's too low and then this one okay that should be fine and then we're gonna take these two engines i'm afraid but we will see can you select vector thrust nozzles oh yeah bit we don't have um i would select vectored but vectored uses a liquid oxidizer which we don't have i think i should be let me check actually for this one i want to just use like engine like <clears throat> normal engines we are gonna use like two rapier engines like in the middles and the rear facing jet so the thrust will be later actually i will after this one after this plane i'm gonna throw in one of the okay so that's one and then These ones will just center out. Just like that. So hopefully that's enough thrust. 
And we do have gimbal off, right? We do have gimbal off. So let me just do some action groups real quick. We're gonna toggle the engine. So, lately, like, offline, I've been obsessed with, uh, like, the... I was watching a video in a documentary about the Ekrano plan and ground effect. And I did download like one of the DLL files here, which is an add-on for ground effect. I don't know if I, it's visible, but I've been lately obsessed with ground effect. I want to try flying in the ground effect and doing VTOL stock because I don't have the DLCs for the VTOL stuff, so... Hmm. We have this custom action group for one, and then this one will also be doing. This one will also do the switch modes. Just in case that we need to uh, switch modes. Uh, switch, switchy, switchy, switchy. And this one is uh, switch mode. And switch mode. And I was like. I was trying to make a video on this, like, for an actual KSP video, not a stream. But I was just like, uh, I don't know how... Like, I was trying to have... I was actually having a hard time. Because I was like... I, I was watching, like, the other, like, KSP uh, Kerbal Space Program YouTubers. And I was, like, trying to get, like, how do they, like, film this? Maybe a time lapse or something. And then I was like, okay, how do we film, like, the actual flying? Like, the actual flying takes a long time. <laughs> And I was like, how do we do this? So we need another set of and set of rings though. Let me just I think that's good enough. So we're gonna need we're gonna add an extra pair down here. This will act as well, yeah. Yes, the crano plans. My brain went burr, but I wanna see that Isek guy. Sure, sure, sure. I will actually do isekai. Sorry about that. Uh, sorry for the actual science lesson. Um, I ha I'm not a scientist, nor am I good at science either. I just recently learned this, so if I'm making a mistake, if you guys are into science out there and I'm making a mistake, please uh, do tell me, cause I know I know quite enough, but not a lot like expert. So. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if like if I might get some like equations or big brain talk wrong. So actually, we're gonna drop this in. I want this right here, and as usual, just Okay, maybe. Oh no, that's not good. <laughs> we already messed up. Wow. Um. Yeah, we're, we're not gonna need that. Mm. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, we don't need that. We're gonna fix this later. We have that stuff. What we wanna do first is actually test it out. So. Um, we're not gonna test it out first because I know the waiting time is gonna be super long. So yeah, ground effect works by having a cushion of air pressure below the wings, body of the aircraft. Yeah, that! I wanna try that ground effect. So like, a while back, I was playing with the boats here. I was trying to make a boat in KSP and I was like, hydrofoil. And no. <laughs> Hydrofoil, the crano plan, um, air ground effect. Like, trying to fly in ground effect though is pretty hard. I was watching videos on it. it seemed pretty hard, so yeah. Um, let's see. We're gonna need wings. So, let's see. Actually, no. It's not easy. Yeah, it's not easy. I actually tried uh, making a little ground effect plane. I can't find it in my like save files, but like I tried flying like ground effect with a little tiny ground effect plane. Like I built 
by watching the little videos. And I was like, yep, no, mm, no, that's hard. It's like super hard. Super hard. I want to try flying it. Like, I was able to do it with our, like, Isekai rockets, but, like, it was just like, eh, we tried. We actually want to put two of these ones. Uh, okay, that's not working, so... Okay, like right there. And they're actually at a good angle. That's good. We don't want the wings to be too big. Or too small. Or too long to be in... In fact, we want it to be just right. So, maybe one more. Maybe one more engine. And what we're gonna use is some space tape. The strut connectors. I want to change the color of the struts just so that they look more... More like it. It looked more like a legit plane with the struts on. So this is a space tape. Let us not forget the the blessings of space tape. Because this will fall apart, I'm sure. <laughs> I'm sure half of this would actually fall apart. So, um, yeah. Let's put some more space tape here. Some more space tape here. Yeah, maybe at the window. There we go. That looks fine. <laughs> and for this one, we're actually gonna do... Mm. Have you ever, have you seen the YouTube updates there now? Like, the dislike button for viewers? Yeah, I actually did see it. So, uh, it's actually... Um, I think it's doing it for my, my uh, videos as well. Like, the dislike button disappeared, but I can still see the dislikes on my, on my actual, like analytics and i was like wow um <laughs> that's a lot of dislikes <laughs> please like my videos don't give me a dislike <laughs> i'm doing my best <laughs> don't dislike actually i can actually see the dislikes <laughs> i can actually see the dislikes don't do it to me <laughs> i'm doing my best don't worry <laughs> oh you bet so, um, let's see. We need more struts. We're gonna... Yeah, this is like a common trend. Like, I'm actually obsessed about, like, building stuff. Like, this is the stuff I actually get, like, super, super, like, horny about. I meant, uh, hyper about. Did I just say horny? Yep, I just said it. I meant really hyper about that, you know, I, like, I like building stuff. Like, actually stems from, like, my younger gen my younger side. When I was, like, younger, I used to, like, build stuff for fun. <laughs> so, um, it it's an obsession. It was, like, a growing obsession. It was only a matter of time until I got my hands on a game that I could build stuff with. So, yeah. And these are- these ones will act as air brakes, so... And we'll also add some big air brakes. Rockets, you know how they are. Yes, rockets! Nico Nico Nia! Ni <laughs> Wait, I'm trying to do your laugh real quick. Wait. <laughs> I can't do your laugh. <laughs> I, I tried. Nico Nico Nia! Komba Komba Kanatsu! Hi. Oh, Moku! Komba Komba Kanatsu! Welcome! Come, how, is, how are you, Moku? How are you, Nico? Ah, uh, chotto matte. So, I think that's enough brakes. I mean, we don't want too much braking power because that would really mess up the flight of the plane. And we're actually gonna name this. Uh, the this is the Isekai X Nexus. Nexus is our uh, our our plane division. So this is the Nexus. Uh, I A X I A X uh, dash. One one, wait one, one five one four a. There we go. 
That's the plane. Or we'll call it with like a little call sign right here. We're gonna call this the. Uh, let's see. We're gonna call this the. Mm, we're gonna call this the the nappy. We're gonna call this the nappy. <laughs> Good! Doing good, how about you? I'm actually doing good! Uh... That's... I... I... How oh, my brain just melted! I have it! Um... I'm glad that you're doing fine, Moko. <laughs> have it! My, my brain melted. We're actually gonna use Elevon's 2B with the... The FAT455 air... Air... Uh, air control surface? It's not... It doesn't generate that much lift. We're gonna use the Elevon 2Bs. These ones are actually pretty... Reliable. So we're actually gonna do the snapping, so it's easier. And these ones will control pitch and roll. So pitch and roll is like to lift up to get lift, and then roll is to you know obviously roll. And then you have the yaw, which is to the rudders on the left and right. So yeah. Yappy, yappy, wappy. Yeah, look at that. So we want this to generate enough lift to carry itself in the water. And what we're gonna do is actually launch this on the water. So it's gonna be a bit tricky. So we're gonna actually have to drive this from the runway to the water. Because I don't have... I don't think I have the mod. Or I have it. I just didn't download it right. So I can't actually like move stuff. Really. And what we're actually gonna do here is... Add some more stock parts real quick. I want to generally use a lot of stock parts. Most of the time for building these planes. Because I don't... I did... A, a viewer did tell me um, on a Discord server to try and use more stock parts. So I'm gonna give it a go. Because usually I mostly use... I mostly use... Um, what's it called? Oh wait, that's wrong. I mostly use, um, what's it called? Mod parts. And, you know, part of this plane is partly mods, maybe. So, we want, it's a bit more, like, different. This one will just act on the yaw. We want this to have a little bit of yaw. Easier to turn. Maybe, wait, let me just get another Elevon right here. Yeah, uh, my brain's melting. Ah, <laughs> yeah, bit. Is everyone's brain still intact? Oh wait, yeah, bit. What's it? Nani kore? Okay, that's not working. That's not working. Okay, that's working. Um, why is okay? Oh, okay. So yeah, so we want. This to do left and right movement, which is yeah. For both sides, which is good. And now we're gonna take um let's see, the tail fin. And we have our Komba Komba Kagozu space station flag. <laughs> which reminds me, um we did we do have a space station now. I kinda use some magic too. Oh wait, I forgot this is a... Okay, we have that. So the first the first version had an engine and mounted it uh, at the rear. We're gonna actually mount this back here. Like, you know, like, um... I don't know if you guys watch, like, videos, like... The Honda Jet it has, like, those little two uh, engines on a pylon on its wing. So it, that's what we're actually gonna do on this one. So let's get some more stock parts. And... Mm. Let's see, we're gonna... Just like right there. Like, exactly right there. Hmm... Actually... Let me try this. Put this one. Like, we want it to be on pylons real quick. Like, right there. And actually, just roll that in. 
Hey, fox. Ah! Oh, which fox? Which is the fox? I'm a f I like foxes. Because I wanna- I wanna eat them. <laughs> ah, you bet! Hello? Yes, I wanna eat the fox. Foxes are my food. Just kidding. I love the fox people. We actually want to put like... Where's the Mark 1 engines? Where are the Mark 1 engines? We are gonna put these up here. So instead of having the engines... Mounted up here... We want this on the side. And... Hopefully this helps with aerodynamics. Also, it might be back to rear heavy. I tried this in. Um, okay, it doesn't want to do it. And what we're gonna do is actually put an, an inline stabilizer just for idiot proofing. There we go. And then we're gonna actually put another um, intake for this. So I wanna try making it as functional as possible. And we're actually gonna take. Yes, another one of these. And then we're gonna drop them here. I want them to be sitting low and give it an angle. That's the. Maybe right there. And what we wanna do is lock the gimbal. We don't want this to move because it will mess up the flight. And let's see. This. That should that should be enough. And for this one, we're gonna do. Um, let's see. Oh, that's a different one. <laughs> um. Yeah. We're gonna. Can is this possible? Wait. Would you like? A, would you use a T-tail for the rudder? A T-tail? What, wait, what's a T-tail? <laughs> Not so it's dumb with the planes. Not so it doesn't know planes that well. A T-tail. Oh! The T-tail. No, no, no. Um, Like, tail. Oh, the T-tail? Oh, wait. That's, <laughs> that's how I'm trying to axe mark here. Uh, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> like, I was trying to... I was thinking of putting the tail like this, and then, like... You know, I was g like, or the tea tail, which is I think this one. Wait, not that. Like this. I mean, I think this would be a better design. Plus this, cause like, you know how with like the Ecrano plans, it would be like a big like tail. Oh, let me just try and just do the snapping real quick, like something like that. And this will actually work on pitch, just pitch. This will be... Yeah. So... Oh, I... I would use a T-tail for the rudder. Uh, okay, okay. Okay, um... This is... The snapping is off, yeah, but... It's just this and we don't want it flat like last time i remember from the ecrano plans they're like like that they had like some sort of angle just to keep them vertical usually ecrano plans would have like an engine down here but just for the sake of thrust looks like the thrust is mostly in the middle hopefully and we're gonna need wheels we're gonna need like actual wheels though, so let's we want them to be small wheels. Just we're nearly done with our build. So let's see. Does this have brakes? Indeed, look good. Ah, I see, I see. That's normal. Yeah, so these are the normal ones. I was thinking of maybe making like the the AN225's tail, which is that iconic like 
really big and really wide design, but I have something planned for that, which ends up becoming one of our space planes SSTLs that we'll build later in the stream. So uh, let's try this one. We're actually gonna fly this soon. I just want to try making sure that we have all the stuff for the flight. Also, check our staging. Better check, better check your staging all the time. Also, with our action groups, we have one and two for switch mode. For three and four, it'll just be the same, basically. Toggle the engine, and then for four, we're gonna have a switch mode, just in case. And actually, it's tilted, so it should affect the ground down here. We do have brakes. Just for precautionary, because I know the the weight of the plane might be like super heavy. Like, I want to like put more struts. Like, we want to put enough struts that we have to make sure this plane doesn't blow up. Because we're not gonna go too crazy because the ram, the CPU intensive game is gonna kill my ram. But we want to just have enough to like. Is this right? Can this be painted? Wow, this thing can be painted. Oh. It can't be painted. <laughs> Wait, we're gonna put an inline stabilizer for each one, which is good. And what we're gonna do here is just move this backwards. Um, with snapping off. Okay, I lied. I can't... Yeah, mm. I think that looks good. Um, we should add some... Okay, we should add some brakes. Just some small brakes here and there. Not too much. Maybe back down here. Let's see. Maybe about here. That should look fine. Hopefully, this type of... Be tall design would work, but I'm not really sure. So let's pack as much kerbals as we can. There's no pilot shoot. Um, yeah, we're gonna pack as much kerbals in here as much as we can. Um, oh, yeah, that's a lot of seats. Mm. I'm sorry. Half of you guys are talented, but we ran out. <laughs> we ran out of kerbals. <laughs> Wow, um, we actually ran out. Um, that's not good. Okay, so we have that. I think that's enough engines to lift it. But I could be wrong. Let's, uh... It is... Can you name the Kerbals? I, I wonder. I don't think we can actually name the Kerbals. The Kerbals have their own name. I mean, you could technically rename the Kerbals. But I read this in a forum once that you can... That like you have to go do like into the files itself and actually like rename them. I I'm not really sure. Let's try it out later. Yeah. I don't think we could rename the Kerbals, but if I could name the Kerbal, I would name this uh, Nico, uh, Litju, Wraith, and so we can't really name the Kerbals out of pe from people. Shorts in the UK experiment, but lift engines in the 19th. Hmm. Yeah, so the UK built uh, lift engines, right? Um, I think the one that's the most rememberable is uh, the, the Harrier. The Harrier fighter jet. I tried to build that too. <laughs> I failed. <laughs> but... Uh, what I could do is actually just name the aircraft after uh, my my sweet little Natsunets and my uh, viewers. So, yeah. Um, let's see. We should be. Yes, the Harrier. It did work well. I still wonder if it's still in service. I'm not really sure, but the hair here looks cool. Like, it can actually fly. So, let's give this a go. Um, before we do that, 
Uh, let's actually put a wheel on it. Wheel down there because I'm pretty sure something is gonna break and. Yeah, we're gonna put this. Let's gonna put a wheel like. Put a wheel back here just, just in case. Likewise with this one. Put a wheel back here. Brakes. Steering is disabled, of course. That's enabled, yep, it disabled. So that should be it. One fixes you. So we're gonna save this and go for a launch. Oh, naming the vehicles. Yeah, so I would name the vehicles after our viewers, which is actually not that bad. That's a bad. It sucks we can't name the Kerbals after people, and this will take long. So uh, because I put I've downloaded so much mods in the game that like KSP will eventually just like black out and probably crash. And yeah, I should probably take out all the all those mods. Help it. So, it's night time apparently. Um, that's not good. Why is it night time? Uh, <laughs> oh, that's not good. Yeah. No! No, 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 no. Yeah, so, that's not good. Let's revert back to the space plane hangar. That wasn't supposed to happen. Those wheels suck. Uh, yeah. Those wheels suck. But these ones are super bouncy. Yeah, bit. I learned that these wheels don't work. <laughs> oh my goodness, no, no. Those wheels are so bouncy. What the heck? Yeah, a bit. Needs bigger wheels, yes. Yes, don't worry about that. We have bigger wheels, don't worry. By bigger wheels, I meant this. Yeah. This one. There we go. We put wheels. And then we should put like a bigger wheel just in case. <laughs> See, I don't want to add too much weight. But I think this is enough. I think we just need more struts. Yeah, we need more struts. Like, we're trying to ESEC guy people in style. We can't just ESEC guy them and have a not so working plane that's that's like a dishonor we have to like let them go in like the most incredible fashion ever and letting them like fly with like terrible <laughs> terrible like results is so bad so let's give this another go hopefully it works um yeah do i have snacks snacks oh oh Look, what the? For snacks. It's gonna take a while. Just let it sit there. It's, this is not the net. Um, this is this is purely um my uh, game loading. It's gonna take a while. Yep, there we go. <laughs> um. So yeah, right now I'm eating snacks and it's a bag of nuts. I, I really love my bag of nuts. Anyway, uh, let's give it a flight. Um, actually, what we want to do here is to have this in the morning. We're gonna turn it on for morning. Cause we want to fly. Yeah, go eat these nuts. Nuts are healthy for you. They're pa good protein. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, let's give it a go. Um, what I'm actually gonna do is turn on. I'm actually gonna turn on is these engines first. So we're gonna try and get to like the water. Oh no, there's like... 
There's like no thrust coming from this. <laughs> this can be a slow play. But that's how we want the ground effect. We want the engine to be a little pointed downward. So this is gonna take a while, so um... Everyone grab your bag of nuts and eat nuts with me. <laughs> Here's a little cinematic view. We're not going very fast, by the way. We're like going... 29 meters per second? Oh, you ate some! Good! Always eat nuts. Nuts are good for you. They are good source of protein, I think. <laughs> yeah, I think it's protein. I'm not sure. I haven't like been in like nursing school in a long time. Ah, uh, yeah, bit. <laughs> I used to be a nurse, nursing I used to like study for nursing. I had to like study all this like health stuff and then I kind of forgot now. So we don't want to go too fast. That's too fast. That's already too fast on the ground. We, got, we still gotta like... Still gotta fly. Oh, it's not flying. Don't worry. This is made for the water. <laughs> this is made for water. This is, I don't know, this is like off-roading, but for a plane. Oh, 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 no! <laughs> no! <laughs> Why? How? We were so far! No! <laughs> it's fine, we'll fly just like this. We'll fly just like this, it's okay. There's still gonna be ground effects somehow. Let's- oh no, yeah, let's fly it like this. Let's fly it like this, and then let's go back to reverting to the actual thing and trying to actually fly this like normal, so... Don't worry, we'll do te two test runs on this. We want to fly this uh, two different times. Um, one broken and one um, not broken. I do have mods on this game, which is Spectra, which is like the graphics mod. And maybe Parallel? I don't think I have Parallax, I'm not sure. But, yeah. It, make, it adds waves to the... It adds waves! And this is not gonna be fun. Let's, let's give it a go. Give it a go now. We can do this! You can do this! Oh! <laughs> it's not doing anything! Let's change it. Hey! Oh, 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 it's working! It's working! It's slowly working! It worked! It worked! You can do it! You can do it! You can do it! Go! Go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go, you can do it! You can do it! Oh my goodness, you can do it! You can do it! Ah! Hey, why are we going backwards? Wait. Whoa! It's doing it! 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 Oh, it's doing it slowly! Whoa! Whoa! It's not doing it! It's not doing it! Ah! 
Oh boy. I mean, it's working, kind of. <laughs> We're not going anywhere. Turn the front engines off. Yes. We're not going anywhere. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's moving forward, actually. We're moving forward. Um, I mean, it works, kind of. <laughs> We're going 19 meters per second on water, it should be fine. Give it a go. Like this is on full throttle, by the way. We're on full throttle. We just we're we're sinking. We're effectively sinking. Look at that. We're we're effectively sinking. <laughs> this is gonna be a submarine soon, and I'm right. It's gonna be a submarine. <laughs> we're too heavy i i think i have a good reason why let's not revert the launch to two hours ago um not i think it's because we're actually too heavy so what i'm gonna do is go back to the the plane hanger and get rid of the the fuel from the bottom part So we're gonna actually go back to the hangar and um well most likely just take out the fuel from the pylons and um effectively try to fly so we're not gonna need the fuel it's okay if we waste a lot of fuel it's I mean, it's definitely okay Yeah, we're not gonna need the fuel. And let's see what that does to the center of gravity, which is up there now, not down. Which is good. Um, move this more. Need some modifications. Yes, we're trying to isekai people. In a way, they actually get isekai with a functional plane. So. Eventually, we will isekai people, but we just gotta make sure they go out in style. Just, we don't want them to like fly and not be in style. That's the outfit. So, let's see. You see the center of thrust. The center of thrust is actually behind us. How about aerodynamic overlay? It's actually up there. So I have I forgot what aerodynamic overlay was, but yeah. Truck coon got buffed with wings. Yes, it is now plane coon. It's plane boat coon. <laughs> plane boat coon. Let's go. Okay, so it should be fine. I think for the engines, we're gonna need more beefier engines, but we're gonna actually put rapier engines here. I'm gonna put rapier engines. And for this one, where's three? I'm actually gonna just toggle the engine. 
I'm gonna put rocket engines back there. Just cause. And we're actually gonna give it a launch. Like, for the lift, there's already, like, a lot of elevons, and we're gonna have to, like, wait two hours again to actually get some... Yeah. Okay, so, always remember to check your staging, because Natsuha never does. And, let's go. There's actually a lot of lift already on the wing. Part, so it should be... There's no fuel. <laughs> How much fuel do we have? Oh my goodness, that's, that's not a lot of fuel. So we have to sacrifice fuel for uh, weight. Like I'm pretty sure you guys can see it through the chat window that the fuel is very, very low. Um, <laughs> that is just funny. There's like no fuel for this. I was like, wait, let me just turn on the overlay. I'm pretty sure you guys can actually see it through the chat box. That's really sad. We don't have a lot of fuel, so... We're gonna have to do this. It's very slow, yes. It's using actual rocket engines. We don't have a lot of fuel. We gotta conserve our fuel. This is what happens, though. We had to cons conserve our fuel. Because, like, we don't have a lot of fuel. Like, I'm pretty sure you guys can see, like, this, 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 this has no fuel. What we're actually gonna do is go down here and break real quick. Just, just give it a good break. How do you add fuel? I mean, you could refuel in the ref- like, in the refueling station if you ever built one. But I never rebuilt I never built a fueling station, only up there in the space station we have that I magically had up in space. Um, but we can just like do that through the editor. Don't worry! You're gonna fly very short. It's gonna be a short level. <laughs> Ah, the craft. Yeah, so in the building editor, I can just add this with fuel, but what we did was get rid of the fuel, obviously, because... Ooh, whoa, <laughs> those brakes are strong! You yeah, have it! Those brakes are super strong. Yeah, actually, if you just go to fuel editor, the fuel stuff, you can actually uh, do it from the building editor. I just removed all the fuel because all the fuel was down here. Let's get to the water. Whoa, the brakes are really hard. So our destination is apparently the, the island over there. So, uh, Let's make our way. Let's uh, add some more distance because we don't want like... Oh yeah. Oh yeah. 
yeah, it works. It works. Yeah. It's working! It's working! Whoa! It's working! It's working! It's working! Oh my goodness, it's actually working! <laughs> it's working! It's working! It's working! Oh! It's working! Above the water. How high can we go? Actually, I'm just curious. We're going higher. We're going about a hundred meters from the surface. Yo! Thank you, guys. We finally did it. We did a. We actually made the Crano Plan boat thing work. Slow flight. It's actually really, really slow, but it actually works. Yeah, think no. It's also it's also thanks to you guys. Yeah. 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 Now let's uh eat that guy though. Once we run out of fuel. And land it. Yeah, actually, that's the that's the. Um, All right, try to get Isak guy today. Let's go. Try to get ESEC guide today. Let's go. Let's go. We can get ESEC guide. Don't worry. We're going really. We're going fast. Really. We're just going down really fast. Let's go. I want to just give it a soft but like ESEC guy landing. Like let's just give it a go right here.
underwater, effectively. We're underwater now. Wait, this, this occurred to me. Is the plane actually like... Oh, it did. Hold? Yeah, hold on. Sink. Dude, it's sink. Sink, you, you've got this. Oh, hold on. Let the caramels go. Let them live. No. Oh, actually, I have a better idea. I'm gonna let these ones live. We're gonna get out the missiles. Hmm. I have a better idea for this one though. Put the space sensor. Build a rocket. <laughs> Let's build a guided rocket. <laughs> I have a better idea. Oh, let's go. But two, I will let them live. Don't worry. For that short time. Well, let them live, don't worry. I don't have them. I don't have the weapons mods, though. Hmm. <laughs> no one died, don't worry, don't worry, we got you. <laughs> anyway, <clears throat> where? Where is it? Oh, yes. No, we can't. Oh. Fuck luck. Alright. <laughs> Go watch the rest of- Oh, no. I will watch the rest of- That was a lot of fun. Oh, thank you for coming, Wraith. Um, thank you for coming. Uh, actually, later I will re- I will name a rocket after you, so, um, yeah. Anyway, have a good day. Thank you for coming. We're gonna need fuel tanks. Just 
a really big I'm gonna use some mod real quick. Mm. I think the Rocco Maxis? Mm, no. Rocco Maxis are too small. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> really the big engine. Problem. <laughs> ah, let's go. Don't worry, I, I don't know how to fly rockets, so you might be lucky. I suck at flying rockets, so you might be lucky. I miss I miss and uh <coughs> Yeah, you might be lucky that I miss. Where is it? Wait, I gotta Yeah, look at my mess of a planet. Where is he? where is where is you? Oh, where are you? I can't even find you. You're lucky. Ah, oh, I can't find you. Where is it? There's the Yappy. Target! Yes, Target! <laughs> Three, two, one! Isekai time! <laughs> No, 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 that way, that way. Yeah. No, 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 <laughs> no, we can- we can do this, don't worry. Oh, we're gonna miss. Yeah, we're gonna miss. Oh, we're gonna miss! We're gonna miss! We're gonna miss! Ah. No! We 
like this. <laughs> All right. We got this. We got this. We got this. Another time. One more time. <laughs> got this one more time let's go <clears throat> I, I figured out how to fly it too works too. This way works too. <laughs> Just cut off the engines. Just... Yeah, this works too. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Wait, no, that's... we're gonna miss it again, aren't we? Come on, just drop, just drop, please drop. Yes. Yes. We're nearing the target. Yes, this works too. Come on. Come on, drop. Drop. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. <laughs> this works too. <laughs> Hopefully this works. Come on. Oh no, the game. The game has frozen. That's not the right way! Oh! No! You must do this! Oh. No! <laughs> what? No! Please let me... Why are you going up? Go down! No! Go up, go up. Please? That's the wrong way, we're... 
That's about a kilometer away. We <laughs> uh, we can do it. We can do this. Don't worry. I got this. I got this. We're almost there. We're almost there. Just a thousand meters. Oh my goodness, no. Ah, uh, don't worry. We we can do this with just pure fly. <laughs> Why? Just. Come on, we can do it. We can do it. We can do it. Yes. 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 No. 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 <laughs> no. Ah. Fine. Fine. I'll let these kerbals live. I. Fine. Fine, we'll let them live. We'll let these kerbals live, okay? That's fine. <sighs> Let's go build... Um... Can we build? So the Crano plan worked. Let's build the plane. Let's build the boat now. Yeah. We're gonna call it the SSS, uh... Not my time for isekai yet. No, not yet. Don't worry. The boat, the boat, boat kun, boat kun will find you. Let's go build the boat. <laughs> boat kun, let's go. Let's build the boat. SS hit you. <laughs> Our SS uh, wraith and hit you. Our oh, it is the bomb, by the way. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. I meant the missile, the SRB, solid rocket booster. Yes. Uh, so we're gonna build a, uh, a VTOL. We're gonna build a boat now. Like an actual boat. It's gonna launch something. Yeah. Let's go build a boat. <laughs> like a small boat. <laughs> Nappy Wappy, your isekai will come, don't worry. Just, just sit tight. Let's go build the boat now. <laughs> Let's go build the boat. <laughs> All right, it's time to build the boat. <laughs> We're actually going to use OPT parts for this one. Um OPTH to be honest. To be exact. <coughs> no, not not OPTH. OPTJ. No, I think yeah, we're gonna use it o OPTH. Another one, hold up. <sighs> Nappy Wappy, it's it's your time. <coughs> <laughs> Add some fins to the missile. Don't worry, the missile doesn't need uh, won't need it because it's gonna be like 
Yeah, it's just... We all know where this is going. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so... Actually, no, that would be hard if we do that, like, a decouple. Yeah, so we're gonna close this one, a track. And track. Show us your space station after. Oh, my space station! The one I magically got up in the space without showing it on video? Oh no! Uh... <laughs> yeah, I kind of cheated on that one. I'll, I'll be honest, I sort of cheated trying to get that space station up there. I discovered the debug menu. Oh, before we do that, I discovered something on PR on uh, VTube Studio just now. I I didn't know that there was like parts, like there's like a uh, default stuff. Like a he like a bunk hammer. Like, wait, let me just open up real quick. Like, hold up. I didn't know there's like a bunk hammer here. I found like a ham- I didn't know- I didn't- I have been using VTube Studio for a long time now that I didn't even know this existed. So, let me just open it up real quick. There's a bunk hammer! Let's go! Let's, yeah, let me just... A bunk hammer near me? Yeah. Yeah, I didn't know this existed. Wow, um... <laughs> I didn't know it existed, yeah, but... I did not know. Now look, there's a bunk hammer near me. I'm getting a bunk hammer. <laughs> yeah, um... I didn't know this existed. I have been using B2 Studio for like the longest time. For like a long time. And I didn't know this actually existed. There's like a... There's like stuff. I didn't know there was props in this like... In this app. So now I know. Here's a bunk camera. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. We have a bunk camera now. <laughs> let's keep it. Let's just keep it right there. Like... <laughs> I wanna go, let's just keep it right there. There's a bonk hammer on my head. <laughs> oh, yeah, bit. <clears throat> yep, and we're gonna need more engine. Aerodynamics. Ah, uh, let's see. We're gonna need this. Hmm, let me see. So, let's see. Don't worry, the boat is gonna get it soon. I'm sorry. I'm- I'm determined to get that boat. Like... Like, let's see. Bunk, bunk. Yes, bunk me. I've been a bad fox. I'm a Neko. <laughs> I have never. I didn't even. <coughs> I. Kumba Kumba Karsi. Ah, wait. Ah, Garnica. Ah, wait. Kibat. Kumba Kumba Kanatsu. Sorry. Kumba Kumba Kanatsu. Yes, we have the bunk hammer. Okay. The boat will not live tonight. We must isekai everyone. And for that to happen, we need to isekai everyone, yeah. So, here's the boat. It's gonna carry one big missile. <coughs> So, let's uh, put some intakes. Many, 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 many intakes right here. Um, let's put it. Let's put intakes everywhere. Okay. 
<clears throat> All right, so where is it? Where is where is the engines? Fuel tanks. So. Let's take out the solid fuel. We're not gonna need that. Yeah. Right there. Hmm. <laughs> yep. These ones. Yeah, like that. <clears throat> and then we're gonna need rudders to like turn the turn this thing so we're gonna like put these in i'm determined that that ship does not stay so um we have that and then we're gonna put wheels and just put these giant some wheels <coughs> and then we're gonna put like two more wheels back in <laughs> oh, these wheels are just training wheels on a boat <laughs> yeah here's some training wheels just just in case oh yeah you, wait you can scale them here's some here's some scaled wheels just for comedic effect <clears throat> oh and um this is this is gonna need a drone um yeah we're gonna need a drone um uh yeah i guess um i mean yeah there's gotta be some isekai guy going on there's one there's the drone and yeah <clears throat> and we're gonna need a radial decoupler i'm so determined and this one's actually gonna be super big yeah and we call this the ss the sss the sss or the ss is it sss or oh Kombakombakanatsu! <coughs> Don't worry. Kombakombakanatsu <coughs> garn! Is it like the. US? Is it the SSS or KSS? I. Mean, I guess. International Space Station? Yeah, I get it. S. ISX? Ah, yeah. ISX, uh. Uh, it. it <clears throat> oh wait, no. Well, yeah. Actually, no. Yeah. And then we'll call this the. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. We'll we'll get the engine ready. <clears throat> yeah. There we go. And then some fins. Let's just add some fins here. Oh. Ooh. 
It looks so happy. Wait, what's this? Oh, yeah, this one, this one. And then... Let's see. Kinda look menacing. <laughs> yeah, like that. Oh, this one, this one will be at the end though. <laughs> oh. Well, we'll just call it the ISX or Isekai X, and. <clears throat> This needs to have a smart guidance system. So this needs a drone or a yeah. Advanced. Oh, it's a command and control. Yes, inline. A drone. Yeah, we're actually gonna use drone here. So here's a drone. Yeah. Yeah, like that. Now, hopefully... <clears throat> it needs batteries. I forgot this is a rover. Um, it's gonna need batteries. Yeah. Let's put some here. Just to save space, let's uh, just scale... <laughs> let's just rescale the batteries because we're gonna need them. Yeah. Gonna need all these batteries. Don't worry, we'll isekai everyone. Honey will come out later also. Don't worry, everyone will be equally isekai underneath all this. Alright, so we have uh, wheels. We have their wheels ready. We need solar panels because. Yeah, we need solar panels. Um, <laughs> yes, this one will have s the bomb will not have solar panels. Yes. Okay, that's enough solar panels. I think that's gonna. Fl I think that's gonna turn. I'm not sure though. Uh, save and launch. So, let's give it a go. We're not gonna need our engines yet. We're gonna use the rovers. Actually, we, we might need the power deal. Okay, this is gonna be slow. No 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 That's not how it was supposed to be done. Yeah but Give it another go and my internet is being slow again, yeah, babe. <laughs> You've got this, um... 
We're gonna use some mods now. I'm just too lazy to put on actual wheels because, yeah. Can I scale this? Yeah, I'm too lazy to actually put wheels, so... Here we go, let's scale some wheels. I'm way too lazy to actually, like, put wheels on, so... There's some mods. Yeah. <coughs> Don't worry, we will make this fun. Oh. Oh. Anyway. Yeah, like that. I need brakes. I need maximum brakes. Oh. <coughs> yeah, like that. Yep. Oh, yeah, we're gonna need brakes too. Yeah, just in case. Some brakes. Save and launch. Let's give it a go. <laughs> oh, yeah, wait. I'll be back real quick. Hold up. 